What's up guys this is Vinod and today we are going to learn a little about the password cracking so for that you need a tool and you can download it from oxid.it/kane.html and here's the link let me save it save the packages as you can see that i am on a linux machine and i am going to use this uh, executable file with the wine emulator the wine is a program from uh, <coughs> which you can uh, Even each and every program which is currently available for Windows, almost everything. Like you can see, I can install the GTA Vice City, Microsoft Office, and all. Okay, so it said that file is already fully retrieved. Nothing to do. So I've installed the Kane enable in my system, and after the installation, you'll get something like that. So there is a great tool. Uh, the name of the tool is Hash Calculator. Okay. and what is the use of hash calculator is if you are going to give it any string like uh, my name and uh, after the numbers so it gonna generate the hashes in different password algorithms like md4 md5 sorted hashes and all so let's calculate the name with 101 or simply with in uh, different password algorithm so in md2 md4 md5 sha1 and all So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy all and I'm going to paste this in my text editor. Okay. So let's see uh, how you can crack those uh, Encrypted password. Actually, the plain text was with, and the encrypted hash is uh, these hashes. So let's start with the MD2. Let's copy it, and uh, there is a tab named Cracker. And here, since we are going to crack a MD2 hash, in here, okay, click on that, and after that, on this Add button, and paste the hash in here, okay. So uh, the list is here, and this is the hash. And uh, to crack this, we are going to use the brute force method. You can also go with the dictionary attack. For that, you need to provide a dictionary dot txt file. Okay, but I'm going to use uh, the brute force attack. So, as you can see, that uh, there are two options to uh, choose from character set. You can go with the default one. like uh, from letter from a to z and number from 0 to 9 and if you want to add some special character you can also add that capital uh, a to z small a to z and special character and all so since we know the password we know the plain text was with so we are going to use the default one okay and uh, we are going to reduce the maximum limit to 7 okay and let's crack the password so it took it took only 1 second to crack the password let's see as you can see that plain text of this hash is weird as you can see what happened why uh, it always suggested to use capital letters small letters and numbers and special character in your password let me tell you why so once again we have to go to the hash calculator and let's make it some uh, give it a complicated string like with um 1 0 and after that uh, some special characters okay so let's calculate the hashes once again and uh, let's paste this hashes once again in the text editor and let's cal again let's go with the md2 copy it go to md2 hash and this one is cracked let's add another one paste the hash so here it is let's try to crack it with the brute force attack and let's see what we are going to see actually it will take more than million years to crack this password from the brute force method since uh, the since my processor is i3 it's nice but it will take it would also take time and one more thing the 
speed of password cracking is depend also depends on your processor processing speed if i uh, you are using an i7 processor maybe there have chances that uh, it will take a little time to crack the password so let's see uh, the plain text was with the 101 and after that uh, shift plus 123 so we know the plain text was let's see uh, how long it will take to crack the password so as you can see it will take millions of years here i am on uh, i3 processor and also i am using it on linux maybe because of that it is uh, slow and here you can see the key weights it's currently matching around 30000 password per second okay and you can also see the current password here one more thing you can if you know a little about password if you know uh, from where it starts or what are the characters in it like uh, with ed 10 and this one uh, this is our custom uh, chart set and let's see so uh, after giving the uh, custom chart set it will also take about uh, 400 years so let's reduce the maximum size uh with the ved3 1016 and after that 9 so the maximum number will line okay let's see so it will take around 28 minutes it's not a big time you can wait to crack the pcs password <laughs> so this is how you can um, uh, test your password from knable and also there are some many great tools like sniffer from there you can uh, fingerprint your network and if you want to crack the mysql password you can you can also crack those passwords from here so thank you for watching and if there is any question please comment it below and please subscribe thank you for watching we'll meet in next video thank you for watching this is ved bye